Our streams really are meant to flow. They connect habitats along the corridor. It's a way for not only fish uh, and macrovertebrates, the bugs that live in the stream, to move freely up and down the river, but it's a corridor for other wildlife. And so that free flowing stream, that is a part of the nature of our rivers and streams. And those barriers that, that humans put in have really broken up that connection through the river system. So the Hamill Woods Dam, like most of the dams in our region, stops fish from moving upstream. And so just like a road that cuts a forest in half or a prairie in half, the dam really cuts the river in half. The removal of the dam has been a project that we've been contemplating for quite a number of years. Some studies that were done proved to us what it was that we had guessed, and that was the ecology of the river down below the dam was different than the ecology of the river above the dam. By removing the dam, it just kind of further enhances the, the work that we do, which is the restoration of our forest reserves and the areas surrounding them. I think removal of the dam will provide a much safer experience for people on the river. Obviously, they won't have to portage around the dam anymore. They can continue to flow through. Now with this dam being removed, we're actually making a connection with this river system all the way from down in the Shanahan area, all the way up into the upper reaches of the east and west branches of the DuPage River. We have free flowing streams all the way through from the northern part of DuPage County, all the way through the river system. This project has been in the back of our minds really for over 20 years now. And so to finally see this dam removed was really exciting to be a part of actually making this project really come to fruition. To tackle some of our biggest issues, particularly in our rivers and streams, we need to do large-scale projects. And those are projects that we as the Conservation Foundation can't do alone. The Conservation Foundation works with groups like the Lower DuPage River Watershed Coalition as a way to really implement our mission of protecting and restoring rivers and streams and watersheds. The partnership that we have with the coalition goes beyond just being a member of the coalition, but also to provide professional staff. Through that, they're able to really put all of their funds uh, towards the work of collecting data, understanding the impacts to the river, and then doing projects like this. Lower DuPage River Watershed Coalition provided the funding for this project as well as the support that we needed when the times came. The Conservation Foundation has been a partner with the Forest Reserve District for years and years and years and the Conservation Foundation has provided that support and assistance for us in land acquisition and other projects throughout the county. It's important to us to combine our efforts with those of others kind of bringing together all of the resources of all of the different entities, the skills and abilities, and just knowledge it has a greater impact when we can do that together. A really important connection that we really hope others will make is getting out on a river. And whether it's sitting on the bank of a river, uh, getting out in your kayak, being out on the river, it just gives you a different appreciation. And it helps to connect us with our just natural environment around us. Even though you might be kayaking past a bridge and there's trucks going by and planes flying over, you have this little bit of a piece that you're paddling through. <laughs>